time very well. And then when I worked at Londo's, I just need to try work it out. <laughs> um, a few years ago, I'm trying to remember. 2000. If I remember correctly, it was around 2007 that I started there, or 2006, I'm not 100% sure, um, to about uh, 2000, and end of, towards the end of 2008, 2009, maybe early 2009, I'm sorry, memory, memory is, my memory is not so good with dates and exact times. facts about a lot of the animals is a book called Beat Around the Bush by the author's name is Trevor Carnaby and that's a really nice general book if you, if you want to have a little bit more in-depth knowledge um, without getting very technical um, and so that covers a lot of things um, from trees, plants to wildlife, lots of little interesting stories about about the wildlife and the, and the trees and the birds. Um, he also has one called um, Beat Around the Bush Birds, so there is a, a specific one on birds and that, but Beat Around the Bush is probably the best sort of general book with to cover almost everything. And the author's name again was Trevor Carnaby. Completely out of character. 
So for me, it would definitely be to respect all animals and always be be conscious um, that they are wild animals and that they might not do what they are supposed to do according to us. So after all, they can't read and write. It's a smile. The amount of smiles coming into into the into their nostrils and that their brain is processing. There's a wind gusting from all directions. Okay guys, we we're gonna fight the good fight and stay with the cats and hopefully they do move. Um, but in the meantime we're gonna cut back to Scott who's hopefully got something that's moving a little bit more than these lines.